Thanks. For, you know, going with me. I know you had other things to do. Just so you know, this is a one-time thing. Okay, we can't always drop everything to go do what you want. Yeah, I know. No, 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 no. Come on. Please don't do this. I gotta go. Good. You're back. Looks like Nebula started tearing up the Novacore outpost. Hopefully we can still catch her. Everybody to the bridge. We're going to the Nova Corps outpost to intercept Nebula. We should have come right away. She's already got Thanos' body. We can't lose her, too. Rocket was my priority. He needed me. I needed you, too, Peter. Star-Lord! We weren't expecting the Guardians to show up. Hey, what's going on? It's Thanos' right hand, Nebula. She appeared out of nowhere, killed several of our soldiers, and sent Thanos' body off in his ship. She's protecting its escape in a stolen Star Blaster! We can still take her down! Weapons loaded. Lethal force has been sanctioned. Get into position. No! I'll be damned if I let the Nova Corps blow my sister to Stardust. We need her alive. Otherwise, we've got no chance of translating the Eternity Forge. Ready? On my orders. Hey, uh... Whatever your name is. Rooks, sir. You can call me Rooks. If you want. It's... kind of a nickname. Great. Listen, Rooks, I'm gonna need you and your guys to stand down. What? Don't shoot the cyborg, Rooks. <laughs> Hilarious, sir. <laughs> I always heard you were a jokester. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> fire when ready. Okay. When words don't work, there's always firepower. You. Guardians, fall back! If you do not follow orders, we will be forced to return fire! No! Star-Lord, we have to follow protocol. Please, listen to him! Nova officers, form a blockade! Peter Quill, by order of the Nova Corps, you will stand down and submit to capture. Star-Lord, Nebula is a wanted fugitive, the biggest threat to the galaxy now that Thanos is dead. She's guilty of multiple crimes. We have explicit orders to eliminate her immediately. We can't afford to be lenient here. It's too risky. Not if you leave her in our custody. Killing her isn't the only option. Look, Nebula is important to us. 
She's got something we need, and we need her alive to save the galaxy. But, sir... You want to see the galaxy destroyed? No, no, sir, I don't. Which is why I have to do this. <sighs> I tried. Officer Rooks, signing off. I hope we can still be friends, and... I think that went well. <laughs> We've got targets on us. On it. That's the last of him. Hold on. Peter Quill, I wasn't expecting you to show your face. Couldn't let the Nova Corps claim your glory. You had to kill me yourself. You brought this upon yourself. So you think. <laughs> you should be thanking me, Nebula. I killed your bully of a dad and kept the Nova Corps off your back. I deserve a medal. How dare you speak that way about my father! <sighs> Would it kill you to handle this all alone, Dr. Kelly? Fine. Look, we need your help. You have to come with us. I will never help you. Had to make this difficult. Disabling her engines. Oh, come on, field's too dense. I can't get a clear shot. We'll have to force her out. your help or your pity. I'd rather die here. I failed, Father. Again. But if you die now, hurtling to your death in a fiery hunk of metal, how will you avenge Thanos? You're running out of time. Give me a sec. I think I'm getting through here. No. Oh, God. the last of it. I don't like knowing Thanos' body is out there somewhere. Oh, one thing at a time. Okay, we have to figure out how this relic works before we start worrying about the dead guy. We're running a scan of her cybernetics, but it's taking some extra time. Just be safe. We need to get Nebula to help us decipher these symbols. Just watch yourself, Peter. She's not exactly happy to be here. Okay, she's definitely not happy to be here. Good thing she's unarmed. Am I right? <laughs> oh. 
Rocket may be able to get her arm working again. We could use it as leverage. <laughs> Don't bother. We are going to dismantle this cyborg piece by piece. Fear won't work on someone like Nebula. You'll just rile her up. <laughs> good. Not good. She was trained to slaughter thousands. I know you're good at knives, but trust me, you attract more flies with honey. What would you want with flies? That's not the point. Flies are a nuisance. You okay to go in there? Frankly, no. I'm not okay. I wanted to reconnect with Nebula. You told me to reconnect with her. And then this happens. Maybe she'll come around someday, but... I can't see her wanting to reconcile anytime soon. Hey, Nebula. Neb. Can I call you Neb? Uh, oh, oh, hey, hey, hey. Do you mind not inviting me? I just want to talk like two civilized people. Can we do that? That's really up to you, isn't it? Thanos wanted this relic, and I know he had you learn how to read these glyphs. That, that's the Eternity Forge. You've heard of it? How did you make those runes appear? I thought it didn't work. I don't know. That's what you're here for. Oh, really? I need you to help me translate them. That's not gonna happen. You think I'd so easily betray my father? Okay. What if I sweeten the deal? Look, you help me with this one teensy tiny little thing, and I will let Rocket reattach your arm. I know you have no intention of helping me. She wants to see me suffer. Killing our father wasn't enough for you. You have to rub it in my face, too. He raised you, Gamora. He loved you. That was not love, Nebula. And you let this imbecile murder him! You are the reason he's gone. You're the one who ruined my life. Whoa, this is a happy place. There's no need for that kind of name calling. I mean, really, imbecile? Oh, sorry I hurt your delicate little feelings. That's enough, Nebula! You pass judgment on me, on my father, but I know you, Gamora. You may have forgotten Tarval, but I haven't. I'm warning you never, never to speak the name. Tarval, Tarval! I'll get what we need from you, one way or another. You want me to talk? Get rid of her. Don't be ridiculous, Nebula. I have nothing to say to you. Gamora? You need to leave. What? Now. If I hear screams, I'm not helping you. She never cared about us. The minute things get difficult, she'll be gone. You'll see. Forget about Gamora, okay? This isn't about her. I know what it's about. Star-Lord, the scan found something. A strange device in the cyborg's skull. These past few days... They've been the worst of my life. I lose my father. Then you show up and capture me and I'm forced to relive everything. Just leave me alone. I'm not trying to hurt you, Nebula. Doesn't matter, does it? You still did. But maybe there's a way to fix that. Oh, God. No, what are you, what are you doing? I know you won't take my word for it. So here, it'll tell you what you need to know. You owe me. Thanks, Nebula. I almost... I told myself I wasn't going to be that person anymore. She just... gets under my skin. Are you kidding? That was awesome! Uh, are you serious? I see you tried my plan. <sighs> the important thing is we got the, uh, the Kree thingy, so. Oh, that is a cipher module. There are not many left in existence. All right, so how does this work? I think I can upload this to my own translator.
Okay. It says... Come find me in the temple. Alpha! Didn't we find it in a temple? My mom said the same thing when I... died. But maybe we missed something. We were a little preoccupied at the time. Come find me. Who do you think me is? That temple was completely abandoned when we showed up. It's... gotta be... whatever is... sending me these visions. I hope you're right. Then we can find out why you're having them in the first place. Exactly. Let's get moving. We're going back to the temple. <laughs> 